Welcome back. This video discusses some selected phenomena of semantics and pragmatics. The practical can be used for in-class meetings with the unit language and linguistics. Here are some examples that illustrate some selected semantic phenomena. Look at these pairs. They exhibit particular meaning relationships. Wide and narrow are in a relationship of opposition. Tulip and flower exhibit a relationship of hierarchy where a tulip is a flower but not every flower is a tulip. And the two examples of face are examples of meaning transfer from the human face to the face of a clock. The second example shows that the meaning of a grammatically correct sentence can be strange. Here it violates our world knowledge. Normally we assume that the failure in an exam is a logical consequence, that is, because of not doing any work, but not the opposite, even though. Here are two examples from pragmatics, that is, from language use. In the sentence, I hereby run to the station, the adverbial hereby is an indicator of a so-called performative utterance, that is, an utterance which acts out the meaning of the verb. But this doesn't work with run. It would work with open. If someone wants to know the time, the logical answer, yes, is not enough. We normally expect more. In this case, the current time.